today I'm going to be filming my college morning routine featuring Spin Brush. So thank you Spin Brush for sponsoring this video. I've worked with them before. I've used their products for years. I really like them. So I have a coupon code for you guys. I'll leave it on the screen. And make sure you go check it out down below if you're interested. They're giving you a huge discount, so get excited for that. But without further ado, this is my college morning routine. This is basically what I do before I go to school. I go to class on Thursdays and Fridays, so this is kind of my routine that I typically do before class. Also, I wanted to mention, you guys, that on Twitter I've started doing polls. So every Friday, you guys get to choose what video goes up on that day. So I will have Twitter polls weekly, probably on Tuesday nights or Monday nights. So make sure that you go follow me on Twitter if you guys want to be a part of picking out Friday's video every week. But yes, without further ado, let's just get started. So after my alarm has woken me up at about 8 or 9 a.m., usually I get up before school at that time, I will go ahead and check all of my notifications and social media for the night. You guys should totally follow me if you aren't already so you guys can keep up with me, my life, and this channel. So after that, I will typically head to the kitchen because literally every morning I'm starving right when I wake up. Then my day has lived through us, no past Doing it all night, all summer Doing it the way I wanna Yeah, I'ma dance my heart out till the dawn But I won't be done when morning comes Doing it all night so every morning for a few months now, I've been making a detox water to drink with my breakfast and pretty much to drink throughout the entire day. So this is my favorite one. I just cut up half of a lemon and half of a lime. And then I make sure to take the seeds out so that they don't get in my drink. Cause I hate when I'm taking a drink and literally like a seed comes up in my straw. That's like one of my biggest pet peeves. So I just go ahead and cut half of each of these up. And then today I decided to add some blackberries, but I usually always do lemon and lime and a lot of ice and a lot of water. I hope you don't expect to be my girlfriend. So today for breakfast, I decided to make a smoothie, and this is one of my favorite smoothies. I just add a little bit of frozen strawberries, some frozen mangoes, and then I added some more blackberries just because I was trying to get rid of these blackberries today so they wouldn't go bad. And then I put a lot of greens, so spinach and things like that, in it. And then I put about a cup of unsweetened almond milk or coconut milk. And then I also put a little bit of this kind of detox, like green, powder that's good for you. Um, you can buy it at Whole Foods and I really like it. I do about half a pack per smoothie and it's supposed to like help your immune system and your body and things like that and you can't really taste it so it's completely fine but this smoothie is seriously so delicious and so healthy. And then I also decided to have a little piece of toast with it so I'm using the healthful steel cut oats and honey bread, literally my favorite bread and then I am just taking some chia and flax seed peanut butter from Trader Joe's and putting half a banana cut up on top. This is what my breakfast kind of just looked like today. So I usually just go ahead, eat that in the living room and chill out and be on my phone and just kind of relax a little bit before I start getting ready for my hectic day at school because when I go to school, it's from 12 to six and I feel like that's so much longer than school in high school. Just because it ends so late, it feels so much longer. So I just like to fuel up and get ready for my day. Moving on to my skincare routine, I'm gonna show you guys what I use. So I use the spin brush from Vanity Planet. I love this thing. I've used it for years. I did a skincare routine a few years ago with this. Literally, I still use it. I love it. I just got a new one that was pink because I love pink. But I'm just taking the Derma E 
Basal Cleanser, and I am putting that on my brush, obviously, and washing my face with that. Then I'm using the Derma E Purifying Youth Serum and applying that all over my skin as my moisturizer. I love Derma E products, you guys. Then I use tea tree oil because it's all natural, and I put that on any breakouts that I have, and it helps minimize them, it helps the redness, and it also just helps them dry up and go away naturally, and I feel like my skin reacts really really well to it and then I'm using the pure lease lip balm this is my fave lip balm literally my lips have not felt softer since using this then after that I go ahead and just quickly make my bed I hate coming home at like six o'clock at night to a really messy room and an unmade bed so I always try and clean up before I go to class and then yeah Man, I'm the macho like Randy. The chopper go out to for granted. This nigga bullet your band. Hope you kill him. So moving on to my hair, if you guys saw my prom get ready with me video, I'm basically doing the exact same thing. I like to curl my hair with this larger curling wand and then when it cools, I go ahead and take my straightener and kind of straighten the ends and fix my bangs and make it a little bit looser and messier and it's a really easy and quick hairstyle and I think it looks super cute. They won't, they won't, they won't be careful but I guess that you don't know me. Now for the makeup, on days when I go to school, I usually keep it pretty simple. So today I'm using the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation in Y245 and this little stippling brush that I got from Amazon for literally like $3. If I can find it, I'll put the link down below. I always forget to put the link down below for this brush for you guys, but it's literally awesome. You need to buy it. It's just as great as the Sigma or Sedona Lace or any of the other brushes like brands. It's amazing. <laughs> So now I am taking the Laneige BB highlighting kind of like pen concealer thing. You can buy it from Target. It's actually super awesome and super convenient. And I'm just putting that under my eyes and all the high points of my face to kind of highlight and illuminate and make me look less tired than I already am for class. Now I am going in with the NYX Cosmetics Set It Don't Fret It powder and I'm just applying that all over my skin just to keep it all matte and in place all day. And then I'm taking Benefit's Hula Bronzer and applying that all over my face, just kind of like to warm it up and make me again look less tired and less dead from the night before because most of the time I stay up with my friends and do fun stuff and it's just not good. <laughs> but now I'm just doing my eyebrows and I have an eyebrow video so if you guys want to see kind of more in detail how I do my eyebrows, I'll leave that down below. Then instead of eyeshadow I'm just skipping that all together and applying a nice wing and then I'm just putting on some mascara and a little bit of lip balm and that's my finished look Okay, so for my outfit, I like to keep it, again, comfy, casual, but still super cute. So my top is from Old Navy. My necklace is from Wet Seal. These boyfriend jeans, which I love, they're kind of like mom-ish. Um, they're really cute, but they are from Forever 21. So cheap. And then I just wore some sandals. And then these are kind of the stuff I will take to school every day. I got some folders, papers, and stuff like that in them. My books, my planner, my pencil bag, some sunglasses, some headphones. And yeah, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much what I take to school. This bag is from Etsy. If I can find it again, I will also put it down below for you guys so you can check it out. Got it forever ago, but I seriously love it and it's so nice for class and that is about it. So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, go check out Spring Brush if you're interested and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was very requested. Again, like I said, I will be hosting Twitter polls every Monday or Tuesday night so you guys can figure out and decide what video you would like to see on Friday. I thought it would be really fun and kind of a little bit more interactive. So yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye.